today I'm going to be using um, different slogans or different um, sentences called you know you Caribbean and it's just pretty much experiences of um, you know growing up in the Caribbean oh, before I get into it guys Caribbean parents are really dramatic and in particular Caribbean people are really dramatic we like to make jokes we like to make fun of everything and just have a good time for example what it's gonna be called is you know you Caribbean so for example one one thing is you know you Caribbean when your parents tell you hey go pick up the keys off the table and you go on the table you go to the table you look for the keys and no keys not right there right guys and you tell your parents say hey i don't see any keys on the table and then your parents like oh if i get up i'm going to have beat you and so now you have to like look around all over the place for the keys and usually where the keys are at it's not there and when your parents realize that the keys were on the table you're not going to tell you sorry you know they'd have been like oh you should have had look for you should have had look harder you caribbean when you ask your parents for help with the homework and they look puzzled when reading the question that they that you asking them for help. So what they're going to be like, you say, like, oh, daddy, help me with this. They're going to read the question, right? And then they're going to read that same question that you asking them for help to you and be like, oh, what the answer is. And they're not going to tell you the answer. That's a real struggle. And then another one is, you know you Caribbean when your parents call you and you say yes, and they say yes, who? And you have to quickly hurry up and say yes, mommy, yes, daddy. And then you know you're Caribbean when anybody that doesn't have the same accent as you, you call them foreigner. Another one is Caribbean when your parent, when you know you're Caribbean, if you listen to soca, dance, or reggae, and calypso all day, every day, repping it. Um, not that we don't listen to R&B, hip hop, and rap, we do, but we mostly listen to like island music, right? All right, you know you're Caribbean. When a homeless person begs you for money, but you say you ain't got nothing on them, say, Go from yourself. <laughs> Lucky homeless people be rude in the Caribbean. Are you Caribbean when your teacher picks on you and asks, What's the answer? But you're looking at your friend saying, Yo, what the answer? And they give you an answer. The answer that you tell the teacher, she say it wrong, and you end up getting slaps for it. Now, this one kind of hits home. It's like, you know you Caribbean when it's crab season, but when you taking those crabs out of that bucket, it going be it going be an exercise because those crabs not trying to get cooked. You know you Caribbean when your parents say they're just around the corner and they take one hour to pick you up. Guys, parents never ever be close when they say they're close. They are usually miles away. You know you Caribbean when hurricane season come. And your family runs to the supermarket to get to stock up on all the food that they should been had stock up early in the year. Um, you know you Caribbean when at least one of your family's got more than one lady, and the whole family know and nobody says anything. That um, you know you Caribbean when you go to school and your friend say lend me a dollar, and just know you not getting that dollar back. You know you not going to get that dollar back, so you not even going to bother ask for it. Another one is you know you Caribbean when you going when you at school and a fight busts out and you be instigating the fight low key just to see some action. You know you Caribbean when your mama says take out the chicken out the freezer but you forget because you playing game and then when you see your mama like parking and whatever you hurry up go in the freezer take out the chicken and run a little water on it to make it look like that chicken been torn up for a long time. All right, you know you Caribbean. Okay, you know you Caribbean when you go by your grandparents' house and they start telling you what they used to do back in the day and who they used to get and all them drama that what grandparents love talk about. You know you Caribbean when you tell your parents you hungry but they say oh we soon reach home. They're not going to stop getting up for you. Uh, you know you Caribbean when your parents send you to the shop or to a store and you try you try buy candy from the change that you that you have left over and you get it. 
you know you're Caribbean when your friends ask you to come over but you know your parents going to say no so you just end up saying no or you say oh she forget and then things them um you know you're Caribbean when parents week come and you won't get lit with your friends on the weekend that one is for like a specific country in the Caribbean came on because parents week only happen there um you know you Caribbean, know you Caribbean when your girlfriend said she want to try something new you say what are you talking about and she like you know what I'm talking about <laughs> yo Caribbean girls different still you know? and then um, you know you Caribbean when your when your daddy ask you you dealing with things but you act like you have got the two shoes or you act like you don't know what he talking about and then um, you know you Caribbean when you hungry at school but you ain't got no lunch money so you drink you dry you try drink a lot of water to like Pull your stomach till you get home. You know you Caribbean when you come home late and your mommy say, Where were you? Where was you? But you make up a story about oh how your friends made you lean and how you have to go this and forget where you, and all them things past curfew too. Alright. You know you Caribbean when the rain start falling and your parents tell you, take the clothes off the line, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up, and you end up getting wet. That's a real struggle. You know you Caribbean when it's mango season and you run down the streets with your friends to pick mangoes off the tree neighbor's house actually and last but certainly not least you know you're Caribbean when you have to change your accent so like foreigners can understand you <laughs> low key